Hi everyone, I'm back with part two of the 12 pound box of jewelry from shopgoodwill.com. So we have another necklace here, this one wood beads. And it's really cute, just a bunch of animals on here. And I don't see a clasp on that. Um, it does look a little loose right here. You can see where the knot is. It's really neat though with all the carved animals. Okay, and then here are some faux pearls. Um, these ones are heavy. I do see a tag on here. That one says uh, Ann Taylor Factory. Then a little rhinestone on the back. Okay, another necklace, some elephants. And then these gold toned coins. Um, okay, so here's the clasp. So goes like that. And then these ones, um, I believe, are just plastic. Okay, so this one is multi-layer bracelet, and I think these are stones. It's like agate, the dragon vein agate, I think it's called something like that. Um, these I'm not sure about. And then looks like there's some missing rhinestones right here. Then these ones feel like plastic. Okay, long necklace here. Um, I think these are plastic beads. And I don't see any clasp on that. So this one, I think it's uh, glass beads, really heavy, tassel here, it's a really pretty color, blue, and silver tone, like a hook for a clasp. Some plastic beads. It's like kind of an orangey red color and stretchy shell bracelet. Another bracelet. And this one's a necklace. Um, the shell pendant. I think it's a shell. It's very thin. See right through it. Um, there's a tag on here for Coldwater Creek. Okay, and then this one is gold tone, a multi-layer beaded necklace, a lobster claw clasp. Okay, and then here is another bracelet, sort of stretches. Um, Kind of a nautical theme with the anchor and this like steering wheel gold tone. So it's kind of a spring. Let's see how it stretches there. Okay, and this one's uh, another necklace. 
the shell pendant. I think that has a little bit of a chip right there in the finish. Um, and then I think these are plastic. Okay, another bracelet, the inlay. And then this one is, um, let's see, I think there's two layers here. Something like that. It's a little tangled, but kind of see how it goes. There's a tag right here. And that one says, uh, Rachel. Okay, a statement necklace here. necklace with a barrel clasp, some seed beads. Okay, this one's multi-layer. See the clasp here. And, and this one's a little tangled, but you could see kind of how it goes. Um, tiger's eye chips. Really pretty. Some also some silver tone beads in there. Okay, this one's another beaded necklace, yellow and white. Kind of a rope design. No clasp on that. Okay, another um necklace with some plastic beads. It's a really nice purple color and barrel clasp. Okay, stretchy bracelet with the wood clasp. And I think, I think it may need restringing. It does feel a little bit loose. So this one cuff bracelet and I don't think this is agate, it's, I believe it's plastic. I don't see any marks on that. And then memory wire bracelet, again with some plastic beads. Okay, more bracelets, stretchy, some shells, and then this one's plastic. Okay, this one, really large, oh my gosh, look how large this necklace is. And I think this probably weighs about a pound, I'm not sure how comfortable that would be wearing it, but here's the clasp. Then these are metal. I think these are like stacked rings or something. You can see them stacked there. Yeah, these are really heavy. I'm not sure what these are. I don't think they're stones. You can kind of see where it's white inside. Maybe some type of um, pottery. Not really sure. Yeah, it's a really large necklace here. Very pretty. Okay, so then these are plastic beads.
and I think these might be stone. It says love has a lot of wear on that. Another bracelet. These beads with the flowers on them. And these are glass beads. I um, think it's a stretchy, yeah, stretchy bracelet just with um, different layers. Okay, another stretchy bracelet. And this one's a shell necklace. Um, I think there's two layers here. Goes like that. Okay, and then this one, it's like magnetic hematite and some other type of, yeah, these ones are some type of crystal stone. You can see there's like crackles in it. Really pretty. Okay, another necklace here. This one's plastic beads. Nice blue color, gold tone clasp. Then, um, Gold tone necklace with the pendant. And some faux pearls. It's kind of like a pinch or box clasp here. And there is a mark back there. And it says Monet. There's a lot of wear on this. Okay, stretchy, I guess, necklace. Okay, so then this one's like a wire, like illusion wire, um, faux pearls. And there's a tag on that. Um, oh, it says Carol Lee. And it does look like it's broken. There's a piece here. Okay, and then this one's a large shell pendant. It's on this cord. Okay, we have a plastic bangle bracelet. And this one's a beaded necklace, a gold tone clasp. Okay, stretchy bracelet has some wear on that. And necklace, the glass bead. Okay, there's a little ring here. And another necklace. Okay, so it goes something like this. And there's a tag on there that says Loft for Ann Taylor. Another um, shell 
necklace, multi-layers. It's really nice, like teal green color, silver tone clasp. Okay, stretchy bracelet. And here's a necklace, a large statement necklace. With all these like coins. And I don't see a tag on here. Let's kind of see how it goes. And then there's the coins. So I don't think these are real coins here. I don't see any marks on that. And there's also little uh, rhinestones here on these pieces. White rhinestones. Very heavy necklace, another heavy one. And that is the end of this box. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time.